Hey guys, uh, this is going to be a quick video on just showing you how to disassemble your battery for your HP P400 RAID controller and just kind of a quick demonstration or uh, actually more of a quick idea on how to actually replace it. So, um, this is the battery controller for the HP P400. Uh, it's fairly basic. The battery is in this part and the controller is right here. So I got two of them. One of them's bad, and I kind of came up with an idea on how to replace it. I f first thought maybe I'd cut open this and you know get access to the wiring and change the battery. And then uh, I, I was kind of looking at it a little closer, and you can kind of see the terminals just on the inside here. Looks like I got to focus there a little, a little too close. Uh, so the terminals are here. So that I was trying to find maybe how far the board went into here. And you, can, you can't really see it because I'm in the basement, it's a little dark, but the board actually stops right there. So, and I was looking at the board closer, and I can see that there's a spring clip right up in here. Let me zoom in a little here. So there's a spring clip uh, right there, and I found if you push on the spring clip and lift the board at the same time, now I'm not going to be able to do it, I bet. Let's try it with one finger. There we go. And you can actually pull the board clean out. So you can actually see the terminals in there. So that's for the battery. So really, now that the battery's bad, I could almost just toss that in the garbage. And I can take this board. And this was my idea. I haven't tried it yet, so you know if anybody wants to try it before my battery comes, let me know. Uh, anyway, we got the, the two terminals here. This one's positive, this one's negative. So you can actually just wire up a 4.8 volt battery and um, hopefully get your RAID controller going because uh, obviously with the battery you get faster performance, you get the, ca the, the actual cache and you get to use RAID 6 on the P400 so um, you know uh, I'm still waiting for my battery, I bought a 4.8 volt 1200 uh, milliamp hour battery but uh, you know if you got one handy give it a try and uh, let me know thanks for watching